Hello everyone, welcome to Study Guide Forum. Today we'll be looking at we are going to be looking at the um specimen for the uh, 2024 YEC biology practical. So what we have here is some of the specimen, but then I want to encourage you to watch to the end and then expect the real analysis of this uh, very um, specimen that will be coming up um, after we must have done this. So uh, the specimen, the specimen A is a gear of a fish and then specimen B is a whole liver from a domestic fowl with gola gallbladder attached. Specimen C is lungs from the domestic fowl. Specimen D is whole gaza gizzard from a domestic fowl. That's a whole gizzard from a domestic fowl. Specimen E is whole intestine from a domestic fowl. Specimen F is ginger rhizome. Specimen G is onion bulb and specimen H is leaf of biophyllum with adventitious roots. So there are other specimens now, but then let's quickly look at what we have. If you look at this, you find out that um, this specimen, this very specimen is, is for respiration, the same thing with this, this other, the lungs is also for respiration and for the liver the liver and gallbladder attached that is they play a very important role the, 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 the liver play a very important role in a conversion of a, a breaking down of amino acid and also in conversion of with the head of the insulin that is in the body system in conversion of a excess sugar toward glycogen where, where it will be stored in the muscle where it will be stored as well, glycogen. So we look at down here, we find out that that means the liver and the intestine they have something in common. And then we go down here and um, we have the ginger, uh, the ginger onion bulb, um, leaf of the bryophyllum with adventures. So we find out that this one has to do with what plants. The whole of this, the whole section of this has to do with what animal. This, one, this other end is what plant. Now, um, the other, the other thing from here now to specimen, specimen, uh, that's to specimen, down to specimen K, they are all plants. They are all plants. Actually, it's not on the board here. And then we we'll talk about the last specimen there, which is specimen R, is also orange seed. Then um, we have the the specimen A, which is a mango seed. All those things, you know that the orange seed and mango seed is a product of a, um, a product of accessual reproduction because it has to do with accessual reproduction. Now, if you look at this, this other one has something to do with what? Um, uh, sorry, mango, mango and orange seed has something to do with sexual reproduction. I'm not sure if that, that was what I said before. I'm not sure. So that's why I have to repeat it. So um, why this other one, ginger, um, ginger, the leaf of the biophyllum and the bulb, they are all under the word we call the one we call a sexual reproduction. So anyway, let me just see, let me just um, pen down the rest of the specimen while we continue in our explanation. So the other specimen, we have a specimen J, which is cassava stem, specimen um, K, which is cassava tuber, specimen L, which is a, a thoracic vertebra, specimen M, humerus bone, and specimen N, mango, mango seed dried, and specimen P, femoral bone and the specimen cure 
Limba, Limba vertebra, and then statement R, we have a orange seed. Now, as we are talking, saying before, remember, um, I told you that this one has to do with this is more of um, uh, cassava tuba is a storage organ. Um, onion happened to be another um, it serves as, as uh, it serves for uh, as uh, this in the uh, asexual reproduction and also as a storage organ, meaning that cassava tuba and that uh, onion happens to be uh, similar. These other ones, mango seed and orange seed, two of them are a product of what? Sexual reproduction. Now we talk about the lumbar vertebra. This is the azi skeleton, a part of the azi skeleton, the same thing with the thoracic vertebra, azi skeleton, while while the uh, humerus, humerus bone and uh, femur bone is a uh, appendicular uh, skeleton. So, and um, in our next video, we are going to be analyzing each of them, talking about some of the possible questions and some of um, some of the possible um, questions and comparing the similarities and all these things that we're going to find in this in all these things. So, if you have not subscribed, we encourage you to do that to subscribe and then watch out for the analysis of each of these things and and i wish you the best as you prepare for your exam thank you so much